Um, first and foremost, I think the Legionnaire is an awesome, it's an awesome ship. Um, it is, it is fantastic, man. It, it's, um, it, it meets, it, it, it goes beyond my expectations. You know, when initially when I thought, um, Um, initially, when I thought of a boarding ship, I, I was thinking maybe they'll probably go with uh, Drake, maybe. You know, I would I would think it's Drake. But it seems like they went with Ambo. And um, essentially, what this is, is it's, it's a very versatile ship. You can use it for bounty hunting, like they said. Um, it has hacking mechanics in it. Uh, built in so as a bounty hunter you, you can't you probably have to use hacking um it's a boarding ship for the military as well so um those that are on that side of the law um can also use it for you know military operations which is fantastic um and lastly you could use it for piracy pirates it's going to be a pirate ship as well they can use it to forcibly board other ships you know so it's it's a fantastic ship i think it's it's it looks really cool it's it, it looks simple but it looks cool as well so um i'm really happy about how it how it's it's looking as well it's uh man it, it, it's it's i think it, it's uh i'm really impressed with it i'm not gonna lie i'm, I'm really impressed with it and um so this goes without uh me mentioning some of my concerns right so these are some some of the concerns i have in, as, as it pertains to this ship and um so when we when we look at some of the images right it looks like it's it's built to to board the, the much larger vessels like your javelins your idrises and ships of that size right um so my very first question my very first question will be will this ship how would it board does like is is boarding only going to happen when a ship is stationary right the ship that you want to board is it is it only going to board when the ship is stationary and um and on the other side of that is can you board while the ship is moving and how is that gonna happen? But right now I'm thinking it's probably only able to board when the ship is stationary. So which means um the mechanic um when this, this ship drops is probably gonna be around the time when they have you know the physical inventory, um the cargo refactor in and um ships are no longer really blowing up completely. Um, but um, they're they're more so um, shutting down or disabling, right? So when you actually completely damage a ship, it wouldn't just fully blow up. It'll just disable itself, and it will leave it there for you to have the opportunity to board it, um, salvage. You know, and also gives an, an opportunity for the owner of the ship and the crew within that ship to also repair and uh, get it back up again. So I think all those mechanics are going to work together um, um, once they, they have this ship out. So, but all in all, I'm, I'm really impressed with the concept of the ship. It's, it, it looks fantastic. It looks awesome. I think uh, it's something that I'll be, uh, I'll be definitely interested in. I'm not going to pledge for it, but it's a ship that I'm definitely going to have in my fleet for sure, 100%. Um, you know, it's uh, it looks really cool. Honestly, it looks like a really cool ship. Just the design alone is fantastic. So, um, and also the the other question I did have, the other question I did have was was more so, um, do you can you only board? through docking collars right like if if you're boarding through only docking collars isn't that a choke point you know what i mean like doesn't it make it a choke point for if you're preferred the attacking force right because 
if you're boarding let's say for example if somebody's boarding me and it's it, it's i only have one docking collar on my ship for example all i need is a, is is a grenade launcher all i need is a grenade launcher and just wait for them to try to uh, um you know enter my ship you know and i can insta kill them like it, it, it's it's so i feel like i don't know if they're going to be able to do it but i feel like this thing should be designed to not only board docking collars but to also board any side of the ship this way it keeps things dynamic right there should i think there should be a mechanic where you can use a ship to actually pierce through the hull of a ship you know and then somehow attached to that side of the ship where you could actually attack from a you know a different angle or an angle that they're not expecting right because if i'm boarding a ship and it's only the docking collar the concern will be um yeah so you know i feel like it should be able to dock you know board through a docking collar as well as any part any you know um part of the ship really if it could physically actually attach to that part of the ship i feel so um i don't know man i don't know i that's the, those are some of the questions i have uh, i'm sure we'll get more details on it once they get the um q a out for it it dropped like one minute ago. 